everyone. I'm here with Mark Abbott. And Mark, welcome. How's it going for you so far? Great, wonderful event. Glad to be here. So what areas of research are you specifically focusing on? Well, most ocean observing systems are really like the artisanal cheese industry. It's one-off, it's for a very special purpose, used once, answer a science question, put on the shelf. We really want to bring that sort of intelligence all the way from the cloud down to those systems so that they're smarter, they're more flexible, really make that innovation much more rapid. What specific area of research are you focusing on now and what problem are you trying to solve? Well, one of the most exciting projects we're involved with is called the Ocean's Twilight Zone. It's a part of the ocean, oh, from maybe 300, 600 feet down to about 3,000 feet. It's a vast ocean ecosystem. We know very little about it. What we think is there might be maybe 100 times the amount of biomass in that world, part of the ocean, than is harvested every year. And what we want to do is to bring new technology to really make it transparent, make everybody, not just the science community, but normal people begin to see that and sort of see that in real time. How do you feel about attending the Microsoft uh, Research Faculty Summit and uh, what have you learned? Well, what's really exciting is to see all the advances Microsoft has made and really not just looking at the office productivity or databases, but really looking at that end-to-end -end knowledge ecosystem so that everybody can begin to participate from sensors all the way up to high-end modeling to engagement and learning and teaching. So looking out into the future, what's one of the key areas of research that you're hoping to focus on to drive disruption? So one of the biggest ones is lowering the barriers to innovation. Most scientists have a great idea and they have to build their entire system, the power, the pressure housing, the data system. How can they actually just focus on where they bring their unique skills and leverage this whole vast ecosystem of design and materials so that they can get their ideas out in the ocean faster? Hey Mark, thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much, it's a great event.